So uh, I thought I would share with you how weird my day has been today. Uh, so this whole day has felt like I went to sleep two hours ago and I'm having a weird fever dream. Uh, so um, we have moles in our yard. You know, like you get. Uh, we've got moles in our backyard, and Julie found this mole stuff uh, that you, that's really good, supposedly. And she says this morning, and to keep in mind, I'm I'm half asleep, and I've been up for like since yesterday afternoon. And I'm trying to stay up all day. That makes everything weirder, because when you're trying to stay awake, everything just gets weirder anyway. So she says, go to the uh, go to the store. Uh, the the uh, go to the seed store and get uh, yeah get the um, the mole stuff. It's called it's called mole exit. You know it's it's all one word, which is a funny pun. Uh, she says get the mole exit at the seed store, and I'm thinking it's going to be like a store, like a, like a normal human store that you go into and have normal people transactions, like normal people. So I get the directions and I go downtown, and uh, it's in uh, it's in a, a a factory building, like a haunted 1930s factory out in godforsaken nowhere that looks like it's literally haunted with Scooby Doo ghosts. So I'm like, okay, you know what? Screw it. Let's do this. Let's go in. So there's like no you don't, there's no place to go in because it's a factory. So I go in the front door because I mean, you know, what are my options? There's a front door. I go into it and I'm greeted by the oldest looking, uh, office foyer I've ever seen. It's like straight out of like the seventies and the lady's like, Oh no, this isn't where you get the seeds. You got to go around back. I'm like, Sure. Okay, let's go around back. Screw it. So I drive around back, and you know it's downtown, so there's like 15 one-way streets, and I finally get around back, and I park in the customer parking lot, and it's it's all it's all semi trucks, and you'll notice I'm dressed in an Adventure Time shirt, the most out of place shirt to go into a factory. So I go into the factory, and it looks like a haunted factory out of Fallout. Like, I'm expecting, like, ghouls to come out and, and, and like, drag me into the underworld, down into hell. But there's, like, seeds everywhere, so I'm like, well, I'm, I'm, I guess I'm in the right track, or I'm at least know where to go when the apocalypse happens. So I go into this office, and it's another old office, and they're like what's your business what's your business name and we'll set you up and i'm like i'm i have a house and i'm getting you know the malls away and they're like cool we can do that I'm like are you sure i don't know if you can but they do it and uh, i get it and a guy comes out with a fork truck and i'm like what are you giving me that you're giving me a fork truck and he has two tiny boxes and i'm like yeah okay let's do it so I get the boxes and I go and uh, I'm like, okay. So I go to the Asian market and I'm like, I want cup of noodles. If you never had cup of noodles, they're, they're awesome. So I'm like, I'm getting curry cup of noodles to take to Gen Con. And I go in the Asian market and A, they don't have cup of noodles. B, there's no air conditioning. And C, uh, all of the refrigeration is off. Now, you might know that your normal, everyday uh, Asian market smells a little weird to us non-Koreans in this case. And um, but this place smells like it smells like the seaside and not a good place. So I'm like, you know, and there's no one in there. That's another thing. There's no one in this door. I, when I say there's no one in the store, I don't mean they're in the back. I mean, this store has an open sign that's flashing, and no one's in the store. It's vacant. 
like I could go in there and, and, and take every product they have and leave. I'm like, yeah, this day can't get anywhere. But then it does. So I go and I get a Red Bull, which I have right here, because I am tired as crap. So I have a coconut Red Bull, as you can see right here, a coconut Red Bull, because, you know, if I'm going to die, it's going to be by caffeine, because, you know, life is short, and if you're going to have a drug, it's going to be caffeine. And uh, I go in there, and um, there's a pimp at 10.30 in the morning uh, buying uh, Red Bulls, and uh, the, uh, like you do. So, uh, this whole morning, I think I actually went to sleep, and I'm having some weird dream. So, uh, anyway, happy Monday.